How y'all doing today? I hope everyone is having a fabulous evening, night, daytime, wherever you are in the world right now. Ooh, how y'all feeling during this lockdown? It's, it's something else, right? To actually like live through this. I know everyone's life have changed in, in some type of dramatic way. Heck, even for myself with my hair, you, you know what I'm saying? Like, geez, this is, this is a lot of hair for me, even though it looks short per se. But for me, if you, you look at my previous videos, you will see that it's a buzz cut. <laughs> so it's, it's, it's new to me. I love it. I love it. All right. So today, a lot of our emotions, like, is not our stuff. Like, is not our shit. And that's something... Like I really recently had like an aha moment, probably like in the past, I would say like six months or something like that, like where it really start to hit me hard. Like I always heard before, like, yeah, you may be feeling like other people's emotions, you know, like when you are standing in front of somebody or maybe you're looking at them on video or whatever the case may be, you just hearing their voice from the phone, like you can pick up their emotions. like. Yes, I've I, I've been feeling that way for a lot of for for a long time, probably most of my conscious life, like where I was aware that I'm a conscious being. You know what I'm saying? And I, I so I always felt that way. However, it wasn't until like a few months ago, like maybe you are in this in this area now, but I'm just speaking from my experience because that's the way how I can really express myself, you know, out to the world is through how how I, I begin to view and I can just say it out loud and see if it resonates with you all, um, who it resonates with or not. So here I am. I'm feeling like these emotions and stuff. And I and like so about six months ago, I really started to grasp like you know what? These feelings that I've been feeling over the years, like, for example, have you ever been like in a really happy state of mind? Like you're happy. You feel like everything is like going right. It's chill. Like it's, 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 it's flowing. Right. And then out of nowhere, like literally feels like out of nowhere, you get like sad or you get like, you get the, 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 you, your your vibe just get lower. You may get like the you feel like depression. You feel me like you or you may start to uh, like cry or something like that. And just these different emotions that's like total on the polarity of what you're feel what what you were just feeling a couple of seconds ago. And so that used to happen to me a lot. And I'm just like I know I'm not tripping. Like what's going on? So it's been like a few times where you may feel that feeling and then. Um, you may talk to somebody, like they may call or whatever, and you're like, oh, okay, well, maybe I'll just pick it up on my friend emotion or somebody that's that you're close to and that you are you are picking up on like their sadness, their anger, or whatever the case may be. So for me, I didn't realize of how much like how sensitive I was to people's energy and that I literally will take their emotions and make it my own without even knowing so a lot of times like for so now so I'll, I'll tell you something that i'm doing right now so for myself so when i'm feeling like if i'm if i especially if i know i'm in a happy state like i have every reason to be happy in the world okay and joyful inside like genuinely like no bs with myself like i'm good with my life right and then i start to feel sad or depressed and stuff and like like, I just feel a shift. You know what I'm saying? Like, you just literally feel like a shift in your energy. You're like, whoa, something changed. Hey, it could have been a spirit that, that walked in the room, for real, for real, you know? Um, and, and that could have changed your energy as well. Um, but also, too, what I realized that I be picking up on, like, people I'm close to or even, you. I'm sure you may do this, too. You're, we're picking up on, like, the collective, you know what I'm saying? Like, the collective emotion. So you may start feeling chaos for no reason however but the reason is is because you are sensitive like you are really in tune to energies and you can start picking up what you're feeling like in the world because remember thoughts emotions even though they're invisible but it's real you know what i'm saying like it's frequencies it's energies that can penetrate and you can pick this stuff up so the thing is we just have to 
that's where discernment comes into play. So when I begin to realize like, you know what, I'm picking on picking up on other people's stuff because now I would say about who who energy am I picking up right now? Because I'm like, first things, so I'm, I'm telling you all like, um, I'm, uh, like the process that I'm going, that I go through now. Is there any reason why I should be feeling sad right now? So if my energy like just changed, like out the blue, I'm like, okay, is there any reason why I should be feeling sad now? Like, why did this just start happening? You know what I'm saying? Then look at the factors. It could just be something like, sometimes it could be as simple as it's not somebody else feeling. It could be you just ate something that lowered your vibration. So maybe that's your answer. You know what I'm saying? Or maybe uh, you just need to drink some water for real just to get your your volatility up because water, like that's, that's life for us. We are a huge amount percentage made of water, okay? So I asked myself, all right, should I be sad right now? And I'm just like, what's going on and then i'll ask my question like okay well am i picking up you know somebody's close to me energy is somebody going through something right now and a lot of times i will like feel or like see the uh, image of like a person like maybe one like a family member or maybe like a friend or something like that and so i'm like okay like this person is going through something for whatever reason <laughs> i felt it okay but now instead of feeling like it's my stuff and then I will start thinking about sad stuff that's in my life from my past and think well maybe that's why I'm feeling sad you know maybe I'm thinking about like x or something that'll pop in my head I'm just like what the hell <laughs> where'd this come from and then I will begin to make up a story of why I should feel sad not why I'm actually sad you see what I'm saying so it's questions ask yourself questions like quality questions for yourself when you feel like that shift of energy in your body, like change and your mood changes, because a lot of times it's not our shit. It's not, it's other people. And one thing that helped me to validate, I'm like, well, how come I know I'm just not making up the stuff that I'm just seeing this person because I don't know, just randomly. Sometimes I'll reach out to the person just to check up on them. You know what I'm saying? And a lot of times, even uh, with like my ex and stuff like that, like during like my, my years of like breakup or stuff like that, I would start feeling something. I'm like, what the, f like intense, intense. And then maybe, I don't know, like randomly talk to them and let them know like, yeah, uh, such and such. Give them like the kind of time frame, like, and then confirm with me, like I was really going through with it or, you know, I really wanted to call you so bad, like during this time, but I didn't. You know what I'm saying? So sometimes you are literally just picking up people's energy, but that doesn't make it your own. So that's where discernment comes into play. Okay. So that, especially for the people who may like be like me with the sensitivities of feeling people's energy. Like I know there are some people who don't hardly feel anything when I'm feeling like as far as the sensitive like sensitivity level and I'm I know there's people who feel way more than me you know with the sensitivity level but that's just something that I I do now to help me discern whether or not if it's my stuff that I have to deal with or is it a friend a family or the collective of the world and I just need to start praying you see what I'm saying so we we do have gifts out there. So it's just to help us so that ourselves won't get exhausted and drained from all of this other people's stuff that's out there. Okay, so let's just be mindful too. Just be mindful about that. You don't have to be, but I'm talking to my tribe, so I feel comfortable talking to you. So just be mindful about the energies that we accept as ourself. The energies that we accept as our own okay because sometimes it can just be fixed with a simple prayer for the person whoever you ask like why am i feeling this way and you can just send that that good that good vibe stuff whatever you do <laughs> you know what i'm saying or if you want to feel it feel it you know feel feel those emotions there's nothing wrong with that but just know you have control over the flow and how you're going to respond to the actual emotions. 
All right. That's what I want to share today on our 100 Days of Our Best You series. All right. I love you. Keep loving yourself. Peace. Mm-hmm. <laughs>